Good morning, going girls. I hope you all are fine. Today's lesson is from your math side book, chapter three. That is subtraction, and topic is about subtracting from zeros. So, dear going girls, when we have to subtract a number from another number containing zero, we do the regrouping in the same way as we do for the other numbers. Let us see how regrouping is done in the given example. Here. We have to subtract three thousand one hundred eighty-seven from six thousand. So first of all, we will write the numbers in the place value column with the larger number above the smaller number, as shown here. Six thousand is minuend, and three thousand one hundred eighty-seven is subtrahend. Now we first subtract the ones, but for that we first try to Regroup the tens and ones, as we cannot subtract seven ones from zero ones. But as there are zero tens and zero hundreds, we regroup the thousands, hundreds, tens, and ones. So six thousands, zero hundreds, and zero tens is equal to five thousands, ten hundreds, and zero tens. Now, ten hundreds and zero tens is equal to nine hundreds and ten tens. Ten tens and zero ones is further equal to nine tens and ten ones. Cross out six in the thousands column and write five. Then, write ten in the hundreds column. Now cross out ten in the hundreds column and write nine. Now cross out ten in the tens column and write nine. Now subtract the regroup number. That is ten ones minus seven ones is equal to three ones. Nine tens minus eight tens is equal to one tens. Nine hundreds minus one hundred is equal to eight hundreds, and five thousands minus three thousands is equal to two thousands. Therefore, two thousand eight hundred thirteen is the answer, and that is called the difference. So, dear going cons, that was all for today. Inshallah, I will be back with. new topic till then take care goodbye